watch it for Dominic Kinnear's quakes. It's the same lineup that won in Minnesota. It's an attacking lineup as well with Danny Hussen on the left-hand side and Urena and Wondolowski up top. Uh, Sebastian Blanco is going to come into that number 10 role where Diego Valeria at the team and Darren Maddox on the left for the injured Dar Darlington Nagby. There's Hussen getting behind Vitas. Hussen's cross. Takes a deflection. Antonella comes out. Another drive. San Jose goal. Jamir Hika, goal San Jose, Earthquakes on top. They will not give up. Each rebound, there was somebody there attacking that ball, and as the ball came back, you can see Jamir Hika is the right man at the right time in the right place to put the Quakes ahead, 1-0. Uranus drive. And the Quakes are peppering Jeff Antonella and that Portland goal here early. Shooting on side at the moment, the Earthquakes. First it was Houston, this time Marco Arena. Good strike as well, that wasn't too far away. The middle, because I think if you scout the Earthquakes, you're probably going to look at the outside play. Houston again! And so, Antonella cannot get comfortable back there as the Quakes, time and time again, Houston seems to just be warming up. They feel the Earthquakes are going to try and attack down the wings, which is what they normally do with Cato or Lima. And now the Quakes are getting these balls 25 out, and they're taking these shots, especially Danny Houston. Hika. Took a hot Victor Bernardes. Going back to that corner kick and the way it broke. Broke for Victor Bernardes. I think 10 out of 10 for the uh, Pelé impersonation on that one. That was pretty good by Big Victor. Florian Youngberg to Wando. Who shot? That's a wonderful two-touch finish by Chris Wondolowski. Look at the first touch, just to kill it into the space, and he bent it around Etanala. That's a quality goal by the U.S. international. And looking for each other and playing well. Started off with a great run. Wondolowski is onside, chips it past. Etanala, goal, San Jose! Team being played on side by Albus Powell on the far side. That's sloppy defensively by the Timbers. But when the chance came to Wondolowski, he had so much to do, and he's done so well just to chip it and let the momentum take it in off the far net in. Take a deflection off of Kofi Sarkoti. Youngberth and Blanco came together. Both players are down. One back by Chara. He's got Arbolata to his left. Feeds the youngster. There's the shot. Bingham covering that near post. Able to block that one aside. Dominic Kinnear uses the players and gets him out of the game. Resting for the next one, potentially. I know it's only 10 minutes. There's a shot and a save by the left foot of David Bingham. If you want a shutout, you've got to come up big. This is what he did on this one. That was the one that actually went under his body, but... The one I thought earlier from Arbaleda was a better save at the near post. Winning most of their games 1-0. And this year, they're losing all their games 1-0. It's just a... Bingham got run into, lost control, but it was cleared off the line. Kato play again. But younger, the way he looks, he just intercepts the pass, then finds the feet of one of his players. He does it time and time again. And that, that will do it as the Quakes... Started off with a Jameer Hika goal in the eighth minute and come away with a 3-0 victory.